Have you ever wondered, does Dr. Thayer adjust anybody else but humans? What if I told you that I've adjusted dogs, cats, and horses and seen amazing results? Uh, check out this furry friend that we adjust on camera. Hey guys, it's me, Geronimo, and Mommy's bringing me to the doctor's. Sometimes she lets me drive. I love Mommy so much. She carries me everywhere, especially when I'm not feeling good. Do 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 do. Oh, careful, Mommy. Don't hit my head on the door. Oh, we're at the chiropractor's. This carpet smells really good. What's this? Hey, Mom, what's the hold up? Let's go. Come on. Oh, man, my leg hurts. I hope the doctor can help me today. Let's talk. They're here. We're here with uh, Geronimo, a, do a dog that needs some help. And so the parent has brought the dog in. And so we're going to introduce the dog and his, get his age and find out what's going on. So what is your dog's name? This is Geronimo. And uh, how old is he? Geronimo is 12 years old. 12 years old. And uh, why did you bring him here today? Uh, Geronimo has injured his back leg. He was jumping up on the couch and fell and injured himself. He fell on our Rumba vacuum cleaner and now he's limping, can't use his back leg. And so he limps down the, down the, down the hallway. We'll show you guys that in a second. And so we're gonna take some x-rays of him and hopefully see if we can help him today. And so anything else? Everything else okay? What, what's, what was his, uh, his throat? He coughs all the time? Uh, yeah, he has a issue with his a collapsed trachea. Trachea. Hey guys, the doctor wants to see me walk, so look at my hip. Limp, 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 limp. If you kind of hold his leg like this, on your side, normal. Like that, like that, okay? Stay right there. Okay, that's good. Let's go. This is all so very strange. Wait, why is it being me on my back? Oh, I don't like this. Not at all. And now you're holding my leg? Oh, I know this is going to help me. So now we're going to develop the x-rays. We can already see what's going on here. Okay, we're at Geronimo here. He's never been adjusted before. First, we're gonna do a little tiny exam on him. Examination of his, of his hip here, okay? And so I went through earlier, I'm gonna do it again on camera for you guys. Take a look at his ankle here, his feet. We're just looking for any kind of response from him to see if anything's sore. I'm at his knee now. Doesn't seem like he has a problem here. Let's go to his hip up here. He doesn't seem to be wincing up here. Let's move some of this stuff. Yeah. As uh, you see from the x rays, I'll show the x rays right now. There's no fracture in his leg at all. Checking out our little furry friend, I don't see any dislocations. And on this next view, I don't see any fractures. So you're good to go. This is the one he landed on. But he has just, again, no real bad pain in here. So I'm thinking this is more neurological. Maybe his hips. Um, his SI joint, so I'm gonna first give him a little adjustment here in his SI joint, see how he does, and uh, work our way through some of these bones. I don't think anything's, none of these are dislocated. He would be hating me right now, but he's not gonna like this adjustment either. So can you hold him like, hold him right up here, just kinda hold him like this. Okay. So I'm gonna get in here, and we're just gonna go literally just a nice little base posterior on him, and if anything is, He doesn't seem to be wincing at all. Oh, 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 there it is. So we're gonna go right here. Whoa, 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 he doesn't like his thoracics messed with. Okay, let's have him walk, let's have him turn walk, let's see what it is. Okay, turn over and back. Good boy. Yeah, okay, here we go, guys. Just a little bit. Yeah, I know, I got you, I got you, I got you. Yeah. Okay, hold on, 